for Farhan participates in a cycling event organized by a cycling society. Farhan is cycling along the street road at the hours after passing the starting point. Acceleration is given by this one. So we know that A is equal to 40 minus 16. And then we see here starting velocity. So starting velocity when T is equal to 0, V is equal to 30 km per hour. So express acceleration function so and the velocity function. So this one, I don't think it is acceleration. It is actually displacement. Okay, because it is S and acceleration is given as this one. Okay, velocity in term of T. So A, so we know that first displacement, velocity, acceleration, right? So from S to V, this one is differentiation. So this one V to A, dv over dt and if you're going another way around so it will be integration okay so you see here to find v to find velocity function v is equal to integration of a dt you see here you want to find displacement you need to know what is your v first so integration of a is equal to so a is equal to 40 minus 16 dt so when you integrate 40 become 40 square divided by 2 16 becomes 16 t and here you will have plus c right so this one you get 2 t square minus 16 t plus c this one is v and it's given that here t is equal to 0 and then v is equal to 30. So when t is equal to 0, v is 30. So we can substitute when v is equal to 30. This one we get 2 0 square minus 16 0 plus c. So c is equal to 30. So here we get the equation where we see that v is equal to 2 t square minus 16 t plus 30. So here we get v is equal to 2 t square minus 16 t plus 30. So if you see the answer at the back, it is actually 2t square minus 60 minus 18. So actually, I don't know where they get 6 because this one is obviously 16. So there's no way you will get 6 here. So I think the back answer is wrong. So this one is more accepted. Okay, you can check with your teacher about the answer here, but I don't think it's not supposed to be 6 here because you have 16 here. So there's no way you get 6 here. Okay, so here we get our V. Alright, we get our V. So we know that after we get our V, can we can only find our displacement is V dt. So when we integrate V, our V is 2t square minus 16t plus 30 dt. So 2t square when we integrate t, 2 plus 1 is 3, divide with the power minus 16. So t, t is actually power of 1. So 1 plus 1 is 2 divided by 2. And then here we have 30 t. Okay. And then don't forget your plus t. So here we get 2 over 3 t cubed minus 8 t square plus 30 t plus c. So we know that, okay, when it cycle, obviously when t is equal to 0, s is equal to 0. So here when t is equal to 0, s is equal to 0. So when we substitute 0 is equal to 2 over 3 times 0 is 0, minus 8 times 0 is 0, this one plus 30 times 0 is 0, plus c. So we know that c is equal to 0. So here we get our s. So s is equal to 2 over 3 t cubed minus 8 t square plus 30 t. So if you see again, the answer in your bag, I think is following this one. That's why it get the value of S at the back. So this one. So S is equal to 2 over 3 mark T cubed minus 8 T squared plus 30 T. So here V is equal to 2 T square minus 16 T plus 30 and then S is equal to 2 over 3 T cubed minus 8 T square plus 30 T. B, 
Prove that Farhan stop instantaneously when t is equal to 3. So, stop instantaneously means that stop velocity is equal to 0. So, here we have 2t square minus 16t plus 30t is equal to 0. So, here we can divide by 2, right? So, this one we get 2 square minus 8t plus 15. So, 15 is actually 5 times 3. So, you get if t minus 5, t minus 3, then negative 5 minus 3, you get negative 8. Or you can just use calculator. So, t is equal to 5 or t is equal to 3. So, the time when the velocity is equal to 0, when t is equal to 5 and when t is equal to 3. So, 1 is it is 3. So, we see, we see, proven. C, find the total distance travelled by Farhan in the first 3 hours. So, we know at the starting point, so when t is equal to 0, s is equal to 0, right? So, when t is equal to 3, so s is equal to, so we substitute inside here, 2 over 3, 3 cubed minus 8, 3 square plus 30, 3. So, is equal to, so here we get square, so 2 times 9. Minus this one is 8 times 9 is 72 plus 90. So here we get 36. So we know that T0 is starting at S is equal to 0. And now at time 3 it is 36. So basically the distance travelled is 36 meter. So the answer again I don't know is following the previous um, the V and S. So that's why you get 9. But then I think the answer is this one.